Our project is a pediatric pelvic model. What it's doing is it's helping nurses be trained to administer pelvic exams to children um, for cases of reported sexual assault. The training they get is only videos and like pictures. The reason that a hands-on training model is necessary is kind of because this kind of exam is so sensitive. It's important for clinical providers to get a hands-on opportunity to practice um, in real life, have that experience of having conducted an examination before they actually go and conduct a real examination on a child. One of the key aspects of our model is that it had to be able to rotate um, the anatomy because the examination is conducted in two different positions. One is like on the back and one is on the belly or on the knees. Just to demonstrate, our model kind of rotates and locks in place at different angles. Um, and this is one of the key aspects of our design is like the adjustable rotation mechanism. The reason I think that rice and university-based settings to kind of produce and design these models is a, is a good way to go is because a lot of times it can be difficult to, even though there's a need for this kind of thing, um, it can be difficult to kind of get commercial interest involved in something so sensitive. It's really impactful and I think that giving uni university students, undergraduates, the opportunity to work on something that they're incredibly passionate about is one of the best reasons why um, this kind of project uh, is well suited to this kind of setting.